is swallowed up in victory. Wow. Okay. How do we say? How do we? How can we be saved? For by grace are you saved through faith, and that not of yourselves. It is the gift of God, not of works, not lest any man boast. But if you look at the next verse, we were created for good works. Ephesians 2:10. Do <clears throat> second Cor uh, Corinthians battle or Chronicles Corinthians 5:21. For he hath made him to be sin for us. Jesus became uh, the the punished the, the punished one who knew no sin that we might be made the righteousness of God in him. Imagine sometimes I imagine. Pag may na bangga na criminal, <laughs> uh, if if there's a criminal and he was bumped by a truck. No, no, I think nobody will... Uh, sometimes you want to bump the criminal uh, because he is bad. But if there is innocent, who is bumped? Uy, kawawa naman, di ba? We are... Anong kawawa sa English? We feel sorry that he was hurt. But if we are the one, sino mga driver dito? Ikaw ang nakabangga ng innocente. Naku, you really feel, feel so sorry because you are the one who caused. That is what happened with Jesus Christ. We are the cause... And he is innocent, and he is suffering for everything. He became sin for us. He knew no sin. Why? That happened to Jesus Christ so that we can be innocent. Yeah, that we might be made righteousness, the righteousness of God in Him. Yeah. If we, so, what is the solution? If we confess our sin, wow. If you are sure that you will be forgiven, are you going to confess your sin? Of course. It's like you have utang. I need you say I have utang, and then you will forgiven for utang. Imagine, no matter how big your utang is, you can be forgiven for that utang, because the one who forgives us from utang is unlimited. He is divine. He is unlimited. He has no limit. He has all the money in the world, and he forgives all our utang, our debts, debts, pala. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us from our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Wow! That is promise. 1 John 1 9. Beloved, now that we are the sons of God, and it doth not yet appear that we shall be when what we shall be, but we know that when he shall appear, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. <laughs> okay. Sin could easily be resisted and overcome only through the mighty agency of the third person. Helen White says, Holy Spirit is third person. Yeah? If somebody comes to preach, there is no, the Holy Spirit is not a part of the personality of God. You quote this one. Third person. Capital P, capital P. That is the Holy Spirit. That means there are three persons in the Holy Spirit. Godhead of the Godhead who would come with no modified energy but in the fullness of divine power. It is the Spirit that makes effectual what has been wrought all out but the world's Redeemer. It is by the Spirit that the heart is made pure. You know what? I used to steal. I think I told you already. No? I used to steal the... You know, in Jalibi there is a number. <laughs> and because uh, sometimes you want to prank, I took out the number and then I was driving in my car with the number in front. He was so proud about that I stole the number in Jalibi. But the Holy Spirit uh, I know, touched my heart. You are doing foolishness. So I was, I was wondering how to return it without getting scolded. <clears throat> but uh, God gave me an idea. I went to CR with the plastic and then I put it in there and then I left it there in the Jalibi CR. So it's back there. <laughs> We are foolish. <clears throat> you know what Paul says? This is a mighty saying. God came to this world to save sinners whom I am the chief. Imagine. Okay, where is where are we? So the Holy Spirit, it is made, it is the Redeemer, it is by the Spirit that the heart is made pure. Through the Spirit, the believer becomes a partaker of the divine nature. Christ has given his spirit as a divine power to overcome all hereditary. Wow. Because Adam and Eve were sinners, all of us also have, you know, it's like banana that is almost falling like this. Kailangan ng tubod, di ba? <clears throat> Yan. Through the Spirit, the believer becomes partaker of the divine nature. Christ has given us to overcome hereditary and cultivated 
tendency to evil and to impress his own character upon his church. Amen. For if we were yet enemies, we were... Oh, mali. For if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God by the death of his son, much more being reconciled, we shall be saved by his life. Adam and Eve were created perfect, but they sinned. Jesus is the second Adam. Try again. And so it is, it is written, the first Adam was made a living soul. The last Adam was made a quickening spirit. Okay, the devil has nothing to do with him. It says here in John 14.30, Herein after I will not talk much about, about uh, with you, but the prince of this world cometh and he has nothing in me. So there is enemy also. Okay. <clears throat> you know what? Jesus, he, this is funny in the, in the Bisaya Bible. It says, nagpakamatay. Si Jesus daw, di ba? This is mistranslation. But the Bible clarifies.